There you go. Game number one. This is game number uno. Nice. Don't run up there. Oh. Go. Go. Nice. Open up here. Nice. Super Marco. Nice whip we're down smash. I was saying Marco gain a gain a big lead over Chowder. Grab pummels for throwing them off. Substitutional Jutsu. It looks like Marco was counting on that and sent the bomb upwards. Nice. Level four there. Oh, looks like. Oh. Looked like Chowder got the lead, but Marco was quick on his feet. Ice it up. Now, spare fight at two stocks. Nice. Upper side read. One, two. Drop air. There he is. Still not yet. So, over there. Nice. Smash. Go to. And Marco is second to lead back. Nice, time Smash. Oh. Up Oh, go for down air is Maruko. And that will shut down any chance of a game stealer for Chowder as he grabs the peak in celebration. Looks like a change of colors for the uh Three, two, one, go. Anyways, game number two is on and a change of colors for chowder. It's not going pink. Nope, nice grab in the back throw. Nope, nice. Oh, there, for there. Oh, nice. Go a couple jabs, sports smash. Not gonna be enough as Mariko will recover. B. Another up B. I sense Mariko down to two stocks. Nice scrap pro. Let's hope fair. Let's hope. Let's hope. Oh, nice grab, back row. 
Nice. More tilt. Or Karapi. Substitutional Jutsu. Fair. So far, both. It's three to two. Chowder. Nice. So for up slash. Nice. Use the up B. There. Oh. So, oh, Double jabs. They're both at exactly the same damage percentage. The difference is Marco is out of stock. And then no amount of jabs will be guaranteed a hit, but the up smash will. Out to tie two, but Marco with that giant damage disadvantage, he needs to rack up as much damage as possible. Nice, go for grab, throw. Still. Grab in a back throw. Nice. I'm just going for an up B. Oh, up smash, up air is Marco doing. Oh, no. oh substitutional jutsu wisely choosing the block. Oh. Position on just once again, but still not in one yet. Four tilt. Arrow. Oh, gain in with the down air. And now that will be one and two. However, it is now a fair fight one stock showdown between Maruko and Chowder. We are now seeing a potentially last scenario here. As already Chowder gave 57% on Maruko. So, up there. Nice. Mordash. So, nice. Fair. Fair. So, whatever. Nice. Ports up there. So not yet. Nice. So far Marco now starting to catch up real good here. Now so we're here. We're not gonna be enough. Marco now has some rage. Bombs away. Down and back throw. Ports up there for Marco. Boomerang forces him to let go of the ledge. Also, two minutes are left in this one. I just realized. This could be. Oh, oh. Looks like he was waiting for something, but the four tilt for Marco not gonna be enough. And it's a four tilt that will do the trick once again. And with 90 seconds remaining in this match, Marco will grab the peak in victory. And now we're going to game number tres. Please game number tres. Also, because I was busy playing some scores in here, are we still? With uh, Sticker Brush Symphony? 
Or is it? Or did they change? Oh, I hear the music now. Never mind. Anyways, while I was asking that, Martha already gained some good damage off of Chowder here. As we. Nice score for an upbeat. Oh, substitution on Jutsu. Doesn't go on see Hope. Portal. Down and down throw. Oh. So, we're there. Nice. Four air. Smash, stop so to be trying to wave for that counter, but it looks like a bomb blow up a little bit too late for that. It is a tie between two stocks, but so far, Chowder trying to leap on Maruko for the lead. Maruko going for down air. Force smash is, not, is missed. Go back here. Oh. All right, here we go. Nice. Go for an upy. Go. Back air. Nice. Ooh, good for a down tilt. And now Madoko has taken a lead back. As right now, we are... Let's see what happens here. And Mariko will hold his stock. He's already in a restricted plate zone. 182. And it looks like he loses his stock. As this is going to be one site, one stock showdown here, folks. But it looks like Mariko starting to win in the lead. He's already got Chowder at 105. Nice one for an upbeat. Here we go. Upbeat. Side beam. Kyler is starting to gain ground. Up there. And a forward tilt and Monocle will take this one. He plays the Wind Waker in celebration. As now we have our winner for the winner side of bracket, and that is Maruko. Now we're going to make the jump into losers. Where we're going to see an epic match between Toru and Ripka. The latter coming from Mexico. Jalisco, to be exact.